show and welcome to Don't Pull the Chicken Switch 1.5 Minute Nugget. I am your host, Kit Alois, checking in today from absolutely beautiful Utah here in the fall. I don't know if you can, if the camera can even pick up on the beautiful colors. I look into the camera here and I see that this bright red tree behind me is not the vibrant colors that my eyes see. So you'll have to take my word for it. It is beautiful run today, beautiful country. If you haven't been to Utah, Man, I just think it is wonderful here. Today's 1.5 minute nugget is a particularly fascinating one for me personally. And it goes along with a story, my own story. So I'm going to put it in the form of a true or false question, ask you to think about it and consider it. Tell me if you think it's true or false. And it has aspects to the don't pull the chicken switch from both perspectives, both when we shouldn't pull the chicken switch and we do or when we should pull the chicken switch and back out wisely, but we don't. So here it is. People don't think about you as much as you think they think about you. True or false? I want to suggest to you that it's unequivocally true that people, in fact, don't think about you as much as you think they think about you. This was advice given to me years ago by a gentleman I didn't particularly like at the time, but it's been super insightful to me as I've gone throughout my journey. At the time, I had made some really dumb chicken switching moves when I pulled the chicken switch when I shouldn't have, and it was very helpful. Now, to put myself in the mode for for providing this nugget today, yesterday, as I was thinking about what I was going to say today, I sat down and wrote down 50 names of people that I know in my life. Now, I didn't include names like my kids or maybe my mom, but I wrote down 50 names in my professional life, my personal life, and then I thought, when is the last time I thought about those people in terms of how are they doing from a perspective of are they chickening out, are they not chickening out? And I was surprised to see, or maybe not surprised to see, validating my theory that, yeah, even though I care about these people, I, I'm not in, my head's not in a spot where I'm thinking about, oh, are they chickening out, are they not chickening out? So my point is this, since people don't think about you and me as much as we think they think about us, why not take some risks? Why not do something that's crazy that you've been wanting to do? Or on the flip side, not worrying about what people are thinking because they're not thinking about you in terms of are you failing, are you not failing, are you good, are you bad, that kind of thing. It can be a fantastic nugget to help us really push forward and go after those things we really want to do. Because in the final analysis, my friends, people aren't thinking about you as much as you think they're thinking about you. Hope you have a great day. See you next time.